Hello. Could you give me your name and uh, your position? Hi, Hi Matthew. Uh, my, my name, name is Andrey Kruzhenitsky. I'm, I'm a Lviv citizen. citizen. I'm, I'm from, from Ukraine. Ukraine. And, and I'm Chief, Chief Inspector, Inspector of Colophon for Ukraine. For Ukraine. Excellent, excellent. So recently uh, you went uh, on a trip to Kharkiv with a group. Uh, who was this group that you went to? We, uh, went with? So, so somehow uh, I, met I met in the um, a, a guy, guy called, called Harry, Harry and, and he owns, owns the trust, trust which, which is called, called Sob Sobyan, Sobyan Trust. trust. It's, it's a, a Scottish, Scottish name, name, so it's so a little, little bit hard, hard for me to, uh, uh, yeah, to say, say this, this word. word. I think I it's Sobkans Trust. trust. Yes. yes. So, so later, later um, these, these guys, guys were, were first in Poland, Poland and the border was Ukraine. Ukraine. They've been feeding uh, people with pizza, pizza refugees. They've, they've been feeding. feeding. They have they mobile have kitchen. kitchen. Uh, they, they got ovens on gas in their vans and. Later, Later on, on, they decided, decided to move, move uh, further to Ukraine. Ukraine. So, so their, their headquarters, headquarters these, these days in Lviv, they are, they are based, based here. here. And, and first, they've been doing Lviv region. region. So, so they've, been they've been traveling, traveling around Lviv region, region visiting, visiting different, different shelters, shelters and, and just inviting, inviting people, people, internally, internally displaced, displaced uh, people, people, Ukrainians, for very tasty pizza, as I know. So they have a they have a food truck, um, a, a pizza food truck, and so they are going around to shelters uh, in, in the Lviv region in the beginning, and they're like what setting up outside of a shelter. Uh, tell me how it would it went in the shelter at Skole. Um, yeah, you yeah, you are, you are right, right, absolutely. absolutely. So, so they, they got, got a pizza, pizza trucks. trucks. Pizza, pizza, by the by way, the way I, would I would mention that it's brought, it's brought for free from, from Italy. Italy. And, and yeah, they yeah, just they pay for shipping. shipping. So, so when they get, get this pizza, pizza they, they, they just, just put, put it into the pizza truck. truck and, and yeah, they're yeah, just they driving, driving all around. around. Uh, first, first, it was the region. region. Uh, they, are they are coming, coming to the shelters, parking there, and just outside, yes, yeah, just next to the shelter, they start cooking. And feed and feed feed, uh, feed people by pizza, very tasty one. And they uh, they have what type of atmosphere there? So yeah, they got GBL huge uh, uh, column. How we call it? Uh, it's uh, speakers. Speakers, yeah, right. GBL huge speakers. So we just have our playlist. We listen for different songs, including Ukrainian songs. And, and people, people have, have fun. fun. Kids, Kids are, are dancing. dancing. They're, they're chatting. chatting. They're, they're talking, talking with each other. Each other. They, we feed them pizza. It's actually, actually very important. important. I, would I would say, say I would I mention would that these, these days, days uh, people, people should, should be united, united as much as possible. possible. So, uh, so uh, that's, that's another, another reason, reason for them to meet, meet to talk, to have a good time, listen to cool music, talk with us. We are dancing. We want them to dance too. Uh, that's, that's fantastic, fantastic atmosphere, atmosphere energe energetically, energetically, it's amazing. And and so uh, recently uh, you talked to these guys and you went on a trip with them uh, to Kharkiv, which Kharkiv has been uh, getting hit by missiles since the beginning of the war. Um, tell us about that experience. Yeah, yeah somehow... Actually, uh, the thing happened in the way that spontaneously I met with one of the uh, managers of pizza trucks, um, Audrey. We had another beer at night. She is actually from Nashville, Tennessee. And then she suggested, she said that she is leaving to Kharkiv next day. So she said, okay, Andrew, what about you? Do you want to go? <laughs> it took for me like five seconds to agree with that. So yeah, it was like two days. First day was Kiev. We did pizza in Irpin next to Kiev. Yeah, people were actually before we start talking about Kharkiv, I will just uh, move step by step. You were you were so, making pizza in Irpin, you said. Exactly. Yes. Wow, that that place was hit pretty hard. 
by the Russians, yes? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So we, uh, we cooked pizza for, <laughs> to the people who are living in a, on a, uh, in a wagon of uh, trains, train wagons, because they had a separate railway where no one is passing by, so they got like eight wagons and many people live there because their houses just few minutes uh, walk, uh, walk from, from that, that place, place are destroyed. destroyed. So, so yeah, we yeah, cooked for these people. people. That, that was, was also great experience. experience. We talked we to them. them. We shared, they shared, they shared their, their experience. experience. So, so we hugged. Yes. Yeah, yeah, so, so that, that was, was amazing. amazing. And then, then uh, the next, next day, day uh, we, we left Kiev early morning. We stayed a night there and we arrived just immediately to the charity night concert night frank, frank sinatra, sinatra concert, concert. Yes. yes and, and there is amazing a guy who is called mark he's a u.s a vet veteran uh, uh south, south korean american, american. Uh, so, so he did an amazing, amazing concert. concert he was, he was so, so nice, nice. Uh, he, he fundraised money for a van he was uh, singing like frank sinatra oh, oh yes. yes i thought he is a frank sinatra it's like frank sinatra's voice it was amazing concert yeah, yeah, so, so he, 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 told he told us later, later that, that he was, was preparing, preparing that concert, concert for another three months. months. It was, it was not, not so easy uh, to do it in Kharkiv. Kharkiv. Oh, so, so the thing is that it, it was in some uh, art, art area, area uh, uh, in a in bunker. bunker. So, so it's, it's very, very comfortable, comfortable like kind, kind of loft style. style. You just, you just go, go downstairs, downstairs. So even if there is some bombing, it's really safe to be there. So that so was that our was first day. day. Yeah, yeah, we also, we also cooked, cooked for the visitors of uh, uh, this concert. concert. We cooked free pizza. Um, yeah, we, yeah, we they donated, by the way, money for uh, for for a, tra for a car. car. Yeah, yeah, for the front. front. Actually, Actually that the car, car which helps the uh, escape, escape car. car yeah, yeah, so, so it goes to the dangerous, dangerous areas, areas and pick pick up people from there and. Uh, goes, goes back. back. So, so we, we stayed, stayed a night in, in Kharkiv, Kharkiv, and next morning we left to the northern part of Kharkiv, Kharkiv which is like super, super close, close to the front. It's like 15 kilometers, kilometers away, 15, maybe 20. So, so mm, we, we cooked, cooked in the, the, the most damaged part of Kharkiv, Kharkiv which is called North Sautivka. If you see all these bombings in Kharkiv of the neighborhoods, uh, that's, uh, that's northern, northern part, part of Kharkiv, Kharkiv which is closer to Russian, Russian border. border. So, so people, people over there were living uh, in a shelter, shelter, I mean, in a basement. basement. We, actually, actually, that's, that's a metro, metro station, station, subway, subway station. station. So they, they, there are there still, still some people living in subway station. station. They, they went, went out of uh, the subway, subway station, station to, to, to have, have our, our pizza. pizza. So there, there was, was a line, line and it wasn't, wasn't finishing for more than four hours. hours. Actually, Actually, it also could prolong longer, longer, but uh, the guys, guys from, from army, army forces, forces came to us and they said, Ukrainians, Ukrainians are, are shelling, shelling very, very close. close. We, we could, could hear they are shelling, shelling to Russian, Russian side. side. So, so they, they said, said, okay, guys, you have 15, 15 minutes to get away from here because there probably can be answers. So that's dangerous. So, so yeah. what was what was your uh, your job there uh, in the pizza food truck? Uh, my, were you were you the the guy chopping wood, the make the fire, or we, were you, I, did I did everything. everything but the the most, the most the important, important for me was to negotiate with, with people who are living, living in an area, area where every day is uh, bombing, bombing shelling every day. Kharkiv is bombed somewhere every day, and people, especially in North South Africa, their their emotional level is super low. They need they need some support. Not many people, not many volunteers, not not so many people are ready to go to this area, and they really need uh, some support. So my role was to talk to them, to smile, we dancing, we tried to make great atmosphere. Uh, I, 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 I got, got uh, great, great 
Ukrainian patriotic playlist, dancing playlist. It was a really great experience because I believe these people need to be more in touch with Ukrainian culture now. Yes, and we tried to make some minutes of for them just to feel great in that terrible time, especially these streets in North South Africa, they were so abandoned and everyone like active youth, they already left. And everyone who is who stays there, they don't have where to go, mostly elders. And they need support, they need attention, they need help, they need yeah that they, they want, want uh they want, want uh, to be felt that, that they are not forgotten yes so uh after Kharkiv, you guys made your uh way back to lviv safe and sound yes uh, first, first we wait to, to uh, uh sorry, sorry. First, first we went to Cherkasy, just, just in the middle, middle of ukraine, ukraine the city, city which, which is, is mm, on dnipro bank, bank and, and that, that side is uh, this, this place, place is super, super wide. wide. I mean, the river. river. You can't can see, see the other side, side of the bank. bank. Yes, yes. super it's wide Dnipro in that area. area. Uh, but, but we also, also visited, visited some, some center. center. Actually, Actually, that, that center, center takes, takes care, care about people, people uh, who, who actually before, before the war, who have been um, after, after after being, being in jail. jail uh, they, also they also took care, care about people who, who like, like women, women who got sexual, sexual harassment. harassment. Actually, Actually, that's, that's now, now also very, um, it's about, about now these days, days sexual harassment. harassment. So, so people, people we were, were feeding, feeding yeah, yeah they, 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 they had, had so, so many, many stories, stories, you know, no personal, personal stories from that center, center I mean, in Charkasa. Yeah, yeah, so, so we, we feed it like, like uh, back, back to Kharkiv, Kharkiv, I think 600, 600 people, people, I think something, something maybe a little, little bit less, less maybe, maybe 400, 400 or 300, 300 in Cherkasa, and I can I specify. Can specify. And, and we, we, we had, had amazing, amazing experience that, that we are we not, are not of, course, of course, we're not, we're not having, having guns, guns we're, we're not having, we don't support maybe some hygienic stuff or whatever they need, food, but yeah, we, we support by food actually, but we also bring some atmosphere to them, what is very important. Yeah. And then we stayed another night in, uh, back to a uh, trip to Lviv, back uh, from Kharkiv. We stayed another night and we left next morning. Actually, I was driving uh, from Cherkasy through Kiev to Lviv all day. Wow. On a manual gear, gear, on the right, right side. side. <laughs> right, right side yeah. with the British car, yes. <laughs> yes. Well, could you um, could you tell us the name of the food truck organization again, once again? Thorpe's Trust. Mm -hmm. And you are the chief inspector of Polifon for Ukraine. Thank you so much for all you do, Andre. Thank you so much, Matthew, for your attention. Have a nice day. You too.